What's up everybody? It's been a while since I made a longer sit down video, but I couldn't pass on today's collection. We're looking at around eight to nine thousand dollars worth of Pokemon product. One of the best collections I've gotten to this day. As you guys see in the background, I did post a short video of this yesterday, but in long with all the cards and the graded slabs you're about to see, this was also in the collection. Every single mainline Pokemon game released up until Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. Everything is complete in the box with the manual. It's, oh man, it's, I was gonna sell all these. I did sell all my Pokemon games in my collection a while ago. Now, I, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna keep all these. It's, it looks too good. I set it up on my shelf. It looks awesome. I can't, I can't get rid of it. All right, let's get into the slabs. And yeah, we're gonna just start right off with a banger. We got a Shadowless Charizard PSA 5. This is valued at around $900. A Secret Rare Pikachu V or EX. I'm so used to saying VMAX, but from Legend Maker. Super cool. Suicune, PSA 7. Got an Entei. I will have all of these slabs posted on my eBay store um, by the end. When this video is live, these should all be up. So if you're interested, you can go ahead and check my eBay out. Send some offers my way. We got a, a nice Dragonite from Fossil, PSA 7. Uh, a White Kyrum from Brown Boundaries Crossed. Nice full art there. Some of the best full arts. Um, we got a black and white Zekrom. This is not from Celebrations, so it's a little more expensive. And then we got the Reshiram as well. Venusaur, PSA 7, base set. A Flareon. Nice PSA 6. Jolteon. PSA 7. Articuno. This one looks really cool on the slab. Just the blue looks nice. Moltres. Yeah, we got all the birds today. PSA 7. And Zapdos. Those 7s are in really nice shape as well. Uh, we got the Black Kyrum in a PSA 9. Man, if this was a 10. So close. We got a Vaporeon PSA 9, super minty looking Vaporeon. Mega Charizard from Flashfire. This is actually the secret rare. Super sweet. Growlithe Shadowless First Edition PSA 8. And then we have some CGC slabs, a lot of modern here. We got uh, Espeon from Evolving Skies. Shadow Rider Calyrex. Genesect from Fusion. And last but not least, Shining Legends Secret Rare Mewtwo. So we also got lots of cool other items that came along with this. We got this awesome Pokedex. So sweet. Uh, Game Boy Advance. There was a Nintendo DS, but the DS was actually a fake. It was the Dialga Palkia one, Diamond and Pearl. And this is also some cards that I found at a garage sale yesterday. A lot of EX stuff, so this is not part of the collection. Just nice nice stuff I found at a garage sale. Um, also got Pikachu and Ash. <laughs> That's nice. I'll keep them in the background. Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. Loose cartridge. Then we got a random sleeved up metal Pikachu. Okay. All right. Let's get into the good stuff. The cards. All righty. So... We'll just browse through, and there you go. Already starting off crazy. We got Secret Rare Pikachu VMAX. Uh, this is a promo from XY. Super expensive for a promo. I think it's around like 18 to 20 bucks. Some Double Crisis Hollows. If you ever run into these, they're actually very expensive, especially the Reverse Hollows. You can sell these for an average around five to six bucks, even the Hollow Rares. Um, this is a card I haven't seen in person before. I never got this promo, but this is a Pokemon Center, Pokemon Go promo. Or you got like some code that you could use inside the app as well. Cynthia's Feelings. Nothing too crazy. We've got a full set of celebrations. There's the awesome Charizard. The classic three. Um, so yeah, there we go. There's the celebrations. I like the black and white ones more, honestly. But the, yeah, there was a full set of celebrations in here. I took out all the like regular hollows and we got the gold Mew. This is the Ditto Peel card. 
Rayquaza, and a Secret Rare Dragonite. Don't worry, guys. It heats up. We got some real crazy stuff in this lot. Starting off already with something crazy. We got Arceus, Dialga, and Palkia. Too bad it's not the alt art. Still a very cool card. Articuno. Some regular Vs. Gengar from the Halloween. And then we got Misty's Tears, the band card. Very cool. And then we got the Grimer band card. Looking up the skirt. And some more full art trainers. Here's one of these cards. I don't know too much information about these. I've seen these before. I'm not sure what they are called exactly. If you know, let me da know down in the comments. But we got a Lickitung. Yeah, fun school. Some really weird cards there. Got a nice Entei, Charmander, Rayquaza. This is one of the more expensive uh, Sword and Shield promos. It was released early on. So not a ton of it was printed, and every time that it would stock up in stores, people would sit, buy it out just because of how expensive the promo was, and still is. So we got some regular common stuff here, nothing too special. Some amazing rares, some secret rares. What's that full art? Oh, just a Bolton. Nice Mewtwo from Unbroken Bonds. Anything else? Nope, nothing too crazy in that pile. On to the next. We got Pikachus. Uh, lots of Pikachus. Yeah, this guy loved Pikachu. There's the Japanese Detective Pikachu. I love those reverse hollows. They look cool. And then, so I think we're just moving into some vintage. That is not on the card. That's a sleeve. It's a kind of cool little sleeve there. Um, we got some vintage hollows here. So we got Lapras. Gengar, Hypno, Snorlax, I love that jungle card, Flareon, Kangaskhan, Mewtwo, Raichu, and Growlithe E-Reader. Oh, there we go. Nice reverse. This guy was also a huge fan of Growlithe. We got a Shadowless Growlithe. Blaine's Growlithe first edition. And what did you know it? Another Growlithe. Oh, another one. <laughs> and now we got Slow King Hollow. Cracked Ice Hollow Foil Charizard. And you can see it's got a nice hollow bleed. Venusaur Hollow Rare. Giovanni's Persian. Dark Dragonite. Yeah, this, this collection is nuts, you guys. You got Onyx Reverse from Unseen Forces. Arceus Diamond and Pearl 50 in a weird sleeve. It kind of makes the card look fake, but I'll take it out can see it's a real card latios ex got some awesome ex cards here latios ex rayquaza ex unfortunately he's got some creasing there still worth some money kyogre ex groudon so cool this card actually had tape all along the corners on it i did remove it here i'll show you should be able to see it see it still but um yeah you can kind of see like the each edge here, it had some tape on it. The original owner of this card, I, he was in good spirit. He was trying to keep his car protected, but you know, nowadays it's like, oh man, that stinks. And these are the illustrator contest cards. I haven't seen these in person before. So we have an awesome Greninja, Bulbasaur. This is from 2022 and then Arcanine. I haven't seen these in person before. I really like them. Pokemon Park Reverse. And here's another one of these really weird cards. I might actually send this off to get graded. Another one I did not know about. I don't even know what to call it, but I looked it up and PSA 10 is selling for like 250 bucks. This condition's worth around like 50. Super cool. We got a size scissor, nice reverse, a ditto reverse, and a nice reverse again. Okay, next pile. Let's see, what are we looking at? Here we are. Um, so we're back into some more common stuff. Oh, just wait, we got a Polyrath. A Lydion. Starmie Reverse. Houndoom. Ooh, that's a cool Jolteon. It's like an animated version. Sudowoodo. Slugma. Blissey. Abra. Jumpluff. Uh, 
is that reverse? No, it's not. And then we've got Reversal Valley. I love that card. And into some more common stuff. Really cool Giratina. What's actually funny about this card is I got this. Uh, that Earlier I showed you that collection of cards from the garage sale I got. This was in the garage sale collection, but it was a fake. And funny enough, that comes in the mail real. Funny how that works out. Some Shining Legends cards right there. Awesome trio. Lugia, Secret. Then we have some Scarlet and Violet cards. Sculpinian. I love this one. One of my favorites. Arcanine EX. Lugia. Um, we got a Japanese Secret Rare there. Fog Crystal. Squirtle. Got a Dark Charizard out of nowhere. <laughs> yeah, this, this is a nice collection, you guys. Really, really cool. Rayquaza. And then we got a ton of Crown Zenith here. All seen this a bunch of times now. We got some cool black and white, or not black and white, XY base set cards. We got Mega Venusaur. Uh, oh, oh, this is from Black and White Era. But we have a Mega Charizard from Flashfire. A Mega Blastoise from Flashfire as well. Or not Flashfire. This is from XY base set. Always get confused. Evolution used the reprint versions of those cards. Alrighty. So we got some more vintage stuff with a mix of modern. Oh, yeah, these Ash Pikachus. I forgot about these. Super cool. And then we got a Pop Series Mute Pikachu. Some more Ash Pikachus. Shadowless Pikachu. How many times am I going to say Pikachu? <laughs> we got the Tops Movie Cards. Here, I'll go like this. These are, these are kind of cool. You don't see these too often. A nice Lugia. Lots of Lugias here. Yeah, I think, are these all Lugia cards? <laughs> There's another Lugia. Hello, Pokemon. Lugia revealed. A nice hollow Pikachu. That one's cool. Now into the rest. Oh, this is a, a promo card. That's weird. Ooh, and <laughs> Graffiti Pikachu, I think this one's called. I can't remember. That one's sweet. Have to get that one graded, probably. Then we got some Ivy Pikachus. Too bad they're not the first edition ones because those came as like a secret rare in the original jungle set, I think it was. But it was super hard to pull. And then we got a Generations Pi or Legendary Treasures Pikachu. Another awesome Pikachu there. Japanese promo. So much great artwork Pikachu. And then here's some other really unknown cards. I was looking at the PSA 10 versions of the card and they were absolutely insane. So I'll definitely be sending those in just to see what, what they might fetch. Really low pop of them. Some more turtle, Butterfree, some just regular vintage stuff here. Nothing too crazy. And that is it. I'm, yeah, that looks like, oh yeah. Okay, so we have some sealed promos here and that's gonna end it off. Thank you guys all for watching. This collection was absolutely insane. Super happy to have it. And, oh yeah, I forgot about these Switch games. And let me know what you guys thought. Later.